Until now, most global health agencies have stated the primary route of transmission for SARS-CoV-2 is through respiratory droplets, up to one millimeter wide, that are expelled when people cough or sneeze. These fall to the ground within one or two meters. They can also be deposited on surfaces from where they can infect people who touch their eyes, nose or mouth. The report by the National Academies cited previous research, including a study in the New England Journal of Medicine, which found that novel coronavirus can float in aerosol droplets less than five microns wide for up to three hours. The study cited an earlier one from University of Nebraska Medical Center researchers, which found viral RNA on hard-to-reach surfaces and in air samples more than two meters away from infected people. The report also cited research from Wuhan University, which found that novel coronavirus can be resuspended in the air when healthcare workers remove their personal protective equipment, clean infected floors, or otherwise operate in infected areas. Also cited in the National Academy's report was a study by University of Hong Kong researchers in nature medicine, which found masks reduced the detection of human coronavirus RNA, not including SARS-CoV-2, in both respiratory droplets and aerosols. That study has yet to undergo peer review.